Some people have asked me for a better explanation of what these videos are, so I'll be including an intro from now on. A randomizer is a game where you have taken items in existing games and randomized their locations. These are called checks. Archipelago is a program used to randomize among many different games. In this case, Mario 64 and Ocarina of Time, which I switch off on and playing. So a chest in Ocarina of Time might have the key for the downstairs of Mario 64's castle, and a star in Mario 64 might contain the iron boots for Ocarina of Time. I then switch back and forth, trying to find the path that leads me to the end of these two classics. I hope you enjoy. What I can do is I can head just straight up north here, or I could have headed into Lost Woods and then gone down the river through the shortcut. It doesn't really matter either way. For now, though, running through the 90s, baby, baby, baby. So. If I can beat this in the next, like, hour and a half, I'll do so. Otherwise, I guess we'll start the next stream with me getting whatever I need. I have not come here as a child, apparently. Which means... Bundle of arrows. I'm pretty sure this is right up against it, but yeah, sure, why not, game? part is, Crimson, I know this is just how you talk, the brain rot is real, but, like, it really just looks like you're a bot at this point. <laughs> Alright. The small key ring for the Shadow Temple. While I'm here... Adulthood, go to a spooky temple and pretty much beat it. Then all I've got to do is figure out where the last strength upgrade is and I win. Uh, light arrows. Light arrows, right. Light arrows. Still need those. So when I'm done with this temple, I'll look up one of the two. Um, actually, it's fastest if I just teleport to the graveyard. Ah! 
And... I have fire now. Fire, fire, yeah. Oh, I just realized I could have done the sun song up there. Eh, whatever. I didn't remember at the time, and that's on me. Hmm. Uh, just... Oh. You know, Crimson, I know the issue. You didn't cook them. They're not raw candy. They're raw rock sirloin. You needed to cook them to make them tender. Silly Crimson. Trust me, I learned. My friend Link uh, used to eat them. Or will eat them someday. I don't know. Tom Wines are weird. It's the miracle of life. Alright, I'm in the clear. And now I just need to get a shortcut back. Well, not shortcut back, I guess, but a shortcut in case I fall. So, invisible platform here. I don't have 32 hearts. I have, uh, I have 17 double hearts. Silly Crimson. Yeah, did you? Good job. I'm so proud of you. Gotta get as many checks as possible to try to afford the hints. And I know I don't need the hint, I could just keep playing and grab everything, but eh. They're a Capelgo system, I might as well use it. Use and abuse it.
Mein, 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 mein. Archipelago. Audacious. Okay. Thank you, sent the trans heart that time. It's kind of small, so it's hard to see. The Spirit Temple boss key. Great. I'm gonna hope that I don't have to fight any more bosses. Just getting to them is, you know, an entire trek. If I need to, I can, but... Eh. I was wearing those boots. The actual reason is because there are spike traps on the floor, and it's a pain in the butt to deal with, but eh. Flip them on and off. Okay. Around there. There, yep. Yeah. Come on. I'm free! Free fallen. Felgo. And... No. It'd be a lot easier with the iron boots. Excuse me. <sighs> Shh. 
should just use the bow. Should have used the bow. Why did it just... I lost all momentum right there. And you're back. Just occurred to me the fan probably turned on. That's why I lost the momentum. No, no. Oh, yeah, the fan. Right. Okay. I'm being stupid. I'm being really stupid. Hey, uh, how you doing, Adora? I'm being dumb. Never fear, for I am here. You tired? That's completely valid. I am not aiming well. I don't have the iron boots. I keep forgetting that. I normally have the iron boots for this part of the game. Oh, you think I should make it a bit bigger next time? I can do that. I was initially testing it out and I had been spamming it, so I was like, ah, it's taking up too much of the screen. But yeah, no, I mean, if it's hard to see on phone, then I should probably adjust it. Well, it matters if it's big enough on phone, because if it's not big enough on the phone, it won't be big enough on anyone watching on their phone like on YouTube or anything. I have to think about how I'm going to be uploading this as well and I want people to be able to see it, so. No, no, come on. That's fine. I will adjust it. I'll make it like a one and a quarter size next time. I just don't feel like adjusting at this moment because I'm getting frustrated with the game. Not because of the game, but because of me. I keep getting impatient and I keep dying. And I'm used to having the Iron Boots, which trivializes this part of the game. But I just keep getting hit by the same things each time. If I wasn't falling for the same traps literally every time, I wouldn't be complaining about it. So that one's off. I'm on fire, but that's fine. That one's off. That one's off. Cool. I've gotten through this, which means this is a checkpoint now. Even if I were to fall off next time. Um, right here? Here, yep. Yep, I quite like it as well. It helps it pop a bit. Thank you. I am a fool, apparently. Ow. Yes. Oh, thank you. You're always a treat. Time to get the main shortcut once I leave this room back to this point. Ow. <laughs> 
So, I think I've already passed the point where I should have gotten what I needed. I'll need to double check which room it was because I thought it was that room right back there. Shadow Temple Whispering Walls Flying Pot. No, that wasn't that then. Whispering Walls. Is that up here? I don't know what Whispering Walls would be. I've been checking every pot I've seen thus far. No, I guess not. I don't know. I'll keep moving on. If I don't find it, I'll have to go back and get it. They were yelling at you to buy them lemonade. That's the light arrows. Please let that actually be the light arrows and not a trap. Have you to tried telling them no? Go get yourself some light arrows. Yep. Alright, just need the strength upgrade and I get to beat this game. <laughs> um, you would have banned Crimson a very long time ago then, because Crimson has just been saying, Streamer, do this. Streamer, I ate a rock. Streamer. They've been doing that for the last, like, two hours. This is just how they are. Why is it weird? Why is it being weird? Come on. Oh, I do remember seeing there being something about an update. Ew. Dang it, Archipelago. Yeah, I have uh, no idea what they changed. I do remember, like, seeing it and think it looked odd. I was trying to use it the other day to see how my banner and everything looked when I was offline.
Honestly, that's just... Okay. Uh, boss cube for the forest temple. I could go beat that if I wanted to. Boss cube for the fire temple. I could go beat that if I wanted to. I am a fool. Tycoon wallet. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, so in the end, I have zero idea where the Whispering Walls is. I guess I'll have to look at it in like a list of where checks are. Unless it's literally right at the end of the dungeon. Also? What's up? Yep. Welcome to the YouTube fame. Totally never been on YouTube before. Anyway. So yeah, in the end, I have absolutely no idea where in the hell the iron boots are. Unless I find them one way right here. Oh. I think I do know where it is. It's at the very beginning of the dungeon. Because I remember some whispering walls at the beginning. The thing is that there are a lot of quote unquote whispering walls in this dungeon. Where walls just like, ooh, come closer if you want to die. And I'm like, mm, maybe don't talk to me. I might have walked that way until you started trying to talk to me, and now I'm less interested. Do I have the boss key? I do. It's Goma. <laughs> Hell yeah. At least it's an easy one. Alright. You get some good sleep, Adora. Night night. Excuse me. I forgot that in this version, I don't think you can hit it. You might be able to hit it when it's on the ceiling. It's just incredibly hard to hit otherwise. Get some good sleep. Boy, boy. Yeah, you can hit it when it's on the ceiling for some reason. Could have one-cycled it. I just did bad. <laughs> appears to be grass, no pots. Yeah, I don't see any, so I'm out of here. The Goron's Ruby. I actually got all those things. Wow. Alright, I don't need that technically i don't think i need the iron boots i might to get the strength upgrade but we'll see in a moment all right for now all right the final one is water temple so i do need the iron boots i'll go get them i technically don't 
technically you can glitch out but it's out of logic and i do not want to try that it just does not sound fun trying to clip through there i've never been great at any of those clips to begin with and i'm not trying to do that on stream okay i'm gonna check a list of checks and see where it would be in the dungeon yeah, it appears to be at the very beginning of the dungeon. It's where I thought it was, I think. Because it's slumped in with a bunch of other ones very early on. So, if I'm right about where it is, then it's literally right over here. I didn't go left, I went right. Ah, that's frustrating. Okay. So, Water Temple, that is Gerudo. You know what? I'm not gonna teleport here. I'm gonna teleport back.